Inside the European Parliament building in Brussels, a screening of the film Letter from Ma Sanja was attended by officials and human rights activists on December 4th to tell his story of being persecuted for practicing Falun Gong, a self-improvement discipline. Sun Yi risked his life filming in China. MEP Tomasz Tchaikovsky, one of the organizers of the screening, said that it's very important for the EU Parliament to speak openly to Chinese authorities about human rights and religious freedom. Uh, some s stories, what nobody knows, are very important for European public and we can, on this movie, shows that uh, really the education camps on concentration camps still exist in China. The screening moved many people in the audience. It was really a moving story and it highlighted all the negative aspects of uh, China's governance and I was really surprised to see so many people attending uh, this event and interested and uh, with interesting questions uh, as well. People often forget about um, other countries and other people who wasn't so happy and lucky as us. The director of the film, Leon Lee, said that many people asked him what they can do to help after watching the screening. Uh, we see people from academics, human rights organizations, uh, from European Parliament and, uh, and many other uh, fields coming to the screening and uh, telling me how moved they were by the story. Many of them specifically ask what they can do to help. Steps must be absolutely taken to try to solve that problem of repression and dictatorial regime uh, in China, but it is also uh, put in practice outside China uh, on Chinese citizens that have fled persecution. MEP Tomasz Tchaikovsky said that the European Parliament will always support human rights. I want to say that we will not never stop our, our activities uh, for human rights. The European Parliament is like bulldozer and bulldozer is very difficult to stop.